Howdy folks, welcome to episode 56. We're going to see if we can get this run down the track this time. So we're going to re-rail and then we'll get we'll get all this put back. There we go. Okay, we're going to try to put it... I want to... Nope, I want to try to put it here. I, you know, I don't understand why they insist on giving it tons of physics and not resetting it when it when they put it on the track. So we're going to run down the hill and this one's trying to walk on my keyboard. I'm gonna walk on your keyboard while you're doing that. And we'll see if we can get this to run down the hill. <laughs> I might have to, uh, <laughs> I might have to reset the cat. I need a reset button for the cat. <laughs> but let's see if we can get this, yeah, we'll see if we can get this to go. Cause I wanna, but part of this is I wanna be able to drive it down that little thing and not just, um, you know, not just re-rail it at the top of the hill and cheat. So, <laughs> Cause, because rolling it down this hill at 80 miles an hour is, is legit, right? <laughs> it's not cheating. All right. It's totally realistic. Okay. So let's see what we can do here. I'm curious to see what the speed is. But let's get it over this little, uh, this is the trick right here. So we'll see if we can get over that first. And open controls, there we go, okay. Nope. Was this one doing, whoops, was this one doing where it just needed to, didn't we end up like just pushing it off the track by doing this last time? It's possible. Seriously? Yeah, it's not even going to move at 97. Yeah, that's odd. It's Is it right at the junction? Are we touching a piece of... Oh, you know what? I'm guessing that is hitting the ground. I'm thinking that might be hitting the ground. Did we... When we redid this track... Yeah, it's it's got to be bouncing off the ground then. That sure was an interesting, uh, <laughs> an interesting bounce, wasn't it? All right, let's try this one more time. See if we can get this to go without bouncing. Yeah, there it goes. Okay. All right, cool. <laughs> we got it passed. See, it's not impossible. All right, let's see what our speed is going to be. 17, 27... 39, 46, 52, 64, 71, 77, 84.2, 82.4. Let's hit the brakes here because that's going to happen. Whoops. Yeah, I should have hit the brakes. <laughs> All right. Because <laughs> it would just land in one piece like that, right? Okay. Let's go like this. And we're going to put it back down here. So we'll say that we came, whoops, down this hill, landed here. All right. <laughs> we're going to try this one more time here. See if we can get it to re-rail. There we go. And of course, it's the opposite direction of what I want it to be facing. Okay. So we're going to put this, we're going to put these cars on and then we're going to, Put all this back together so let's get this there we go and let's see how many cars we can line on here let's go like this can we get it to there we go all right and then we're going to do this sort of deal is it oh the brakes are on that's why okay See, it finally they finally fixed it so that the the brakes don't don't act stupid. Okay, so that the physics is on. All right, and we're going to see if we can get a few of these put back up here. And we'll go like this. We need to do There we go. 
Let's get a couple more. Do we have like eight of these? Is that how many it was? There we go. And we'll get the brakes on this. Whoops. Why did it do that? <laughs> All right. Let's see how many of these we can get before the sun goes down, right? Because that's going to be the next thing that we have to contend with. Can we? There it is. All right. We got the flat car. And we're going to take the brakes off here. All right, is that four of them? That's four of them, and I think we have eight total. Or was it six? Or was it just five? Was it five of them? Yeah, I don't see any more on the map. Let's check the map. See if we can get the map to show up. Really? Huh. F2. No? Okay. Nope, the map's not going to show up. All right. But I'm not seeing them on the map over here, and they should have shown up if there were more. Apparently that one didn't have the brakes on. Alright, let's double check. Make sure that the brakes aren't on. Zero percent. I, my monitor's moved. <laughs> okay, so we'll turn the lights on here. Can we turn the lights on? Oh, is it? Does this one use the generator? All right. I think this one is using the generator. Yep. Okay. So we're gonna go forward, and then we're gonna go like this. And then once the last one passes, we're gonna we're gonna flip the switch. There we go. Okay. And then we're going to go turn it back. All right. We're going to let it. There we go. Take it easy here. Nice. And I think we might have to, um, I think we might have to move these other cars. Do we have other cars there? Or is that just the... I can't tell. I think that's just the side of the... The side of the thing. It looks like there's cars sitting on that track, doesn't it? Let's jump off here. Whoops. Wrong way. No. Okay, it's just these things. Alright. It looked like there were cars there. And is this one... Yeah, this one's going the right direction. Okay, cool. So I think we're good as far as that goes. I think we're good to... Uh, to just drive back so let's do that if we can no why it turned on a sander all right reverser oh that's why i was slowing down i'm like why am i slowing down on a flat thing that would be why <laughs> okay and then we have to make sure that once we get over to this other end we need to make sure that we have whatever switches in place I mean, we can even we can even go around the big loop to loop to turn this around if we wanted to, but I don't think we need to. So we'll see if we can get this to to go, and then we'll figure out what our next move is. We did bring the iron, uh, the coal over, and so I think we need to bring the box cars. Now I do not remember. Do the, is it the box cars or the stock cars, or one or the other, or both? that can't handle high speed. Were those were those broken like that? Or was that something else that I'm... Am I remembering it wrong? So we'll turn that off. Because I know there was something... I know we had some problems and I think it was the box cars. It might be the stock cars. I'll have to check. Well, I guess we'll just hook a bunch of them up and go really fast with them. <laughs> See what happens, right? I think it was the boxcars that we couldn't bring up the hill at high speed either. But yeah, we're going to have to figure that out, and then we can start bringing like, the tools. And we're going to have to bring the pipes. And I think we're going to bring the pipes 
the long way around the thing. Are these the box cars right here? These are the box cars right here. Okay. All right, cool. So we can stop this train here. Almost. We'll let it go a little bit further. And yeah, that's fine. Okay. We need to do that too. All right, let's see what we've got over here. I think we just have three box cars. Yeah, I think the stock cars we had to get rid of, if that if that's what it was. So we're going to take Let me see here. We're going to put We're going to hook on these box cars first of all. I'm trying to decide whether I want to do that with this or this. I think we'll use this engine to do that. And we'll go like this. Can we? Yep, okay. See if we can get into this one. There we go. All right, so we're gonna go put the box cars on this outer loop and then put the other ones on the other loop. Okay, let's do that. We're just It's just gonna be shunting today. I think, I'm not sure if we're gonna get a long run in today or not. I, but I suspect there's going to be a whole lot of shunting going on. <laughs> uh, Jerry Lee Lewis always reminds me of. <laughs> All right. And then we're going to switch this one. And then we're going to switch. No, we're not going to switch that one. Okay, so we're going to go like this. And let's double check and make sure. Okay, and then we have brakes on this, right? Can we get up on top? Let's make sure we have some brakes on something here. Brakes 100. Okay. I mean, I suppose I could see it on the outline on the thingy, too. All right, let's go like this. We're going to back up into this. There we go. See, the other thing is you have two hands, but you only have one mouse cursor. And so you can't do something like, you know, pull the whistle while you're while you're controlling the <clears throat> regulator. You got to turn it on and then let go and use the whistle with your one hand. And <laughs> then while your thing is picking up too much speed or whatever, if you're too slow on the whistle, right? Okay, so this should be enough speed to get us there. I hope. <laughs> I don't know why I got to be so gentle about this, but yeah. And they still haven't come out with a new update yet. I'm not sure what's going on. If they're gonna, what they're gonna do. Here we go. You ready? See if we can remove some fingers. I mean, they've always been fairly. I really wish you could. Re oh, you can reach the brakes from there. Okay, and then zero. And zero. Okay. Can reach the brakes. Um, but yeah, I don't know what they're doing with, with updates as far as... You can do it. Come on. You can do it. I can't F the engine. <laughs> it's just telling me door hatch, really? I am hitting the F key, right? Does this... Does this window open? No, the windows don't open. Why is it suddenly not letting me jump into the train? There we go. Okay, that was odd. All right. Let's do this. We'll bring the box cars over. I think we can get three of them over the hill at a time. So we'll do that with the Climax. That's why we had three of them hooked up together. And it must have been the stock cars that were failing because we don't have any of those. All right, and then we're going to get to this switch here. We need to get to that switch. So yeah, it's been, I think, a month now since the last update. So we'll see what they come up with. They must be doing something cool. All right, or he's, you know, taking a vacation. 
two month long vacation, right? Okay. There we go. We'll get these on the side track. And then I think what we need to do is we're going to need to move the engine off of this too at some point. So we might as well do that while we're still over here. We'll get that off the track. Is it, do I not have any brakes? I don't have any brakes. There we go. I don't know why the brake wasn't working. Why wasn't the brake working? Okay, so we're going to put the brakes back on this one. And we're going to disconnect that. And then we're going to move this back up. So we're going to go forward. Whoops. Yeah, I'm not sure why the brakes didn't turn on. We'll just call it a bug and blame somebody else, right? Where do we want to sit this? Because we need to come back with the other one far enough. Yeah, we'll put it on this then. We'll put it on this line. Go like this. All right, and then we're gonna flip this one. There we go. <laughs> and then we're back to this game again. There we go. <laughs> Put this back on this line and then we can get our other two swapped out. So we got lots of swapping to do. We're gonna take the stake cars off We're going to take the stake cars off and then swap them for the box cars. So we're going to do this, and I think we need to probably add more fuel. There we go. All right. We're going to bring this back. And then I think... We can put this on the front. We've got the power. We have the technology. I hope if this isn't too far forward, we do. <laughs> we have the technology. If that is too far forward, then, well, we kind of can with more effort. It'll just take more effort. All right, and then we need to get past this switch so that we can go onto this line here a little bit more. Keep going. There you go. All right. So flip this switch here. You can do it. All right. And then we're going to go forward. There we go. Put this one. It looks like we're out of the fall on that other track. So I think we can sit these on here. And we're almost there. Almost there. We could get a little bit farther. A little bit more. And we'll see if that'll do it. That should do it. Whoops, brakes. Okay, so we need to put the brakes on one of these cars. And then we'll disconnect. And then are we gonna be able to make it past this? I think we'll be able to make it past. I don't know, we'll see. We're gonna find out, aren't we? <laughs> All right, let's see. Go like this, break. Let's go just a little bit. I think we're, I think we're good. I think we're going to be good. We'll see, because the collision boxes aren't always like to the exact pixel of what the visual is, depending on how it was designed, you know, how it was modeled and stuff. Okay, and then we're going to back up into that one. So we need to make sure we have a pin on the back of this too. Yep, we have a pin there. 
and we have that and we have brakes okay let's do this a little bit more go like this there we go all right cool and we'll turn this regulator off if we can turn the regulator off hit the brakes all right so we just need to take this brake off I think it was this one there we go double check and make sure these are off and these are off okay and we should be able to pull all these now we have what 96 Oh, that's why, because we can only fill up three of these anyway. Okay. All right, we're going to turn on the sander. And we're going to take this up the hill. Get our boxcars up there. And I think we were taking those down to the... Yeah, we were taking them down the big hill so that we could sell them at the, the place that's right there anyway. There we go. I'm curious. I want to leave it on 100 because I'm curious to see if it'll spin. If it'll spin out. Because it never did before, so... Since the update, that is. If you know what I mean. <laughs> Not never, uh, as in, like, never in the history of the game. Okay. So. We have... Yeah, we have a while left. And we have a cat. We have a guest conductor. Guest conductor. Don't we? Are you guest conducting? <laughs> I think that was a no. Let's see what our speed is. We're still at 11.1, 11.3. We're still ho hovering at max speed. Is this the turning point or was it back there? I can never remember. Yep, we're still at full speed, so I think we're totally fine on this. And then, yeah, we'll take this down, get the boxcars filled up. And then I think we need to bring the pipe cars. And we'll probably need to bring those. Um, we're going to bring those with the, the ET engine or the Class 70 or whatever. I think the ET was better. I forget why. We tried to use the Class 70 and... I don't remember what the deal was with it. It was doing something bad. But it did something that made me not, not want to use it compared to the ET. That's all I remember now. All right. Was it that it just had like such a low top speed or something? Or was, was it coming off the tracks or what? I don't know. But anyway, are we almost night again? Okay. We'll turn on our lights. And I think once we get to the top here, we're going to do the same thing where we just turn the brakes on all the box cars. So I'm going to need to let go of the cat with my other hand so I can drive. <laughs> she wasn't too happy about that. Okay. I'm going to go. I'm offended. I'm going to go sit somewhere else. I think what we'll do is we'll turn on the brakes on the box cars once we get on the flat here. There we go. Get on the flat part. And we'll, we'll, uh, yeah, we'll turn on the brakes on the box cars and then pull them down the hill. See if we can pull through their brakes and then start pulling down the hill. Okay. Since we only have one person, we don't have anybody else to, to work the brakes here. Brakes on brakes on and I don't want to do train controls through the through the other interface because that's where it's crashing speaking of crashing let's do this let's save the game and let's do um, episode 56 a all right so
So we've got all three brakes. We're going to do this. You can do it. There we go. All right. And here we go down the hill. Yep, we'll be able to pull through the brakes. Okay. We can turn off the sander and the bell. Let's see what kind of speed we get going here. There we go. All right. Now we're good. Now we should be able to just roll down the hill. So we'll see what happens with 9, 9.10. We are gaining some speed. 12. Okay. All right. We don't, we don't need, um, yeah, basically we're, we're going to go back and forth between these two. So we'll keep it a little slow here because at the bottom we're going to hit that part where we really go way overboard. I think the bottom gets really steep. So we're going to kind of go back and forth between like 10 and 15. 15, 14. All right. I'm going to turn the brakes on when I hit 15 and turn them off when it hits 10. So I know you can't see the numbers, but <laughs> we're going a little bit faster and a little bit slower. And it seems like we're speeding up at about the same rate that we slowed up, decelerating. Okay. 13. There we go. Okay. I think we're pretty much going to be good for the rest of this hill. 16, 15. Yeah, because the rest of this hill isn't that steep anyway. All right, so we're going to go turn off the brakes on the box cars if we can. Whoops. So that we don't have to pull through them to go flat. Let's see if we can get it to coast. Let's see if we can get it to coast all the way past the switch. Nice. And we're going to switch this as soon as that goes past. There we go. Okay. So let's go get back in. Whoops. <laughs> that wasn't disorienting at all. Okay. Whoops. Nope. Wrong way. All right. We turn off the generator. That's what I was looking for. Okay. And then I think we're going to need to switch the other switch too once we get to the yard. We're going to want to switch the other one so that we go left instead of the other way. Let's go do that. We'll let this coast because I think it gains a little bit of speed on the way in. So we're going to let this go like this. And then we're going to make sure these switches are good. Those are both going that way. Okay. Yep. We're good. This will roll us into the yard. I think. I think it gives us a little bit of momentum there. Try this again. There we go. All right. And there's the ET, so we can, we're going to need to bring, bring all of the log cars. We're going to have to figure that one out. I'm going to have to figure out how to bring all the log cars across the map. I might have to just use a different engine that's on the other side instead of driving this one all the way across. So, because the other option is to cheat and just to teleport that one across, <laughs> you know, to re-rail it on the other side and claim that we that we drove it all right yeah we're on a little bit of a downhill here and let's get we'll get the first one lined up here let's see if we can get some boxes in here kind of cool that we're putting boxes in the box car right okay so let's see which one it puts it into suppose we need to open the door too. There we go. 
There. Alright, we'll open this one too. While it's loading. Alright, so that loaded that car. And then we're going to load this next one. See if it'll load this one now. It looks like it. Yep, okay. And then we're going to load the third car. I like how you can't hear the... It's, is it using up all the sound channels or something? <laughs> it's like you can barely hear the chug, chug, chug. Alright. And a little bit more. Alright. And we'll try that. Let's go around here. Let's see if it'll load this one up. We might even have gone a little bit too far. Don't drop it on the ground. Yeah, stupid thing. Okay, we need to back it up a little bit. <laughs> Alright, that's where it like just automatically keeps going, right? Back this up just a little bit. There we go. And you should be able to see it on the map. It, it's, you know, should be able to line it up by doing that on the map. Is this right? Is that showing... Yeah, it looks like that's showing the right. Because this is the end of the stairs. Okay. Yep. Alright, so that stuff's going to load up. Um, we're going to uh, get the pipes going here, too. So we need to find our cars that have all of those on them. And we probably need to put these somewhere. Maybe. Maybe we can put these on a, a siding up there. There we go. Can we get down there? There we go. So we're going to want to find... Yeah, we're going to want to put these on the siding. I mean, they are... They're, they're not in the way of anything right now, are they? Not specifically. Alright. So... Yeah, they're not specifically in the way of anything, so we could actually leave them there. Go like this. We're going to disconnect that. Okay, so this one we want to bring to wherever the cars are. So let's go like this. Yeah, it's not doing it. It's not bringing up the map now. now I wonder if it's because I have the Yeah, something's something's weird because F2 isn't even uh, isn't even making the mouse disappear. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. So we're gonna have to find them the old-fashioned way, right? Where are all the log cars? I think they're up at the up at the um, what you call it. And we don't need to go to this to teleport, do we? Okay. So let's check out the logging camp here. Whoops check out where our thing is that's not our logging cars okay so they're not up here and let's try the sawmill did we bring them to the I think it's the other sawmill I think they're at the other sawmill because those are the skeleton cars whoops can we get out of there are we stuck you really get stuck in the lake okay so we've got two of them here. We've got two of them there, and then where else? Let's throw some of these, let's throw some fuel in here so that we can move those out of there. And then where else are those gonna be? I think they're at the other logging camp is where they are. Okay, so let's get these out here, I suppose. Because you can't put the pipes on the skeleton cars. You can only put the pipes on the... And let me double check that. Locomotives. Skeleton car. Yeah, see, you can only put logs on them. The other one, you can put the steel pipes. Okay. Let's close. And this is going to go that way. 
and this isn't going to run us off the track, right? This is going to go that way, and then where do we want those is the question. I'm not sure where we're going to want them. I think we're going to want them on this track. And then this is just a regular switch. Yeah, okay. All right, so we're going to want to bring these out to here because we need nine of the log cars in total. Let's double check before we do all this stuff. Let's double check and make sure that they are where I think they are. They're not there. Then they're either at this logging camp at the top of the hill or they're at the um, they're on the big siding by the oil field. They're not up here. Okay, so they must be on the siding by the logging thing. Let's double check again. <laughs> Probably be easier if we had a map, right? But I'm not sure why the, the extended map is not coming up. Because that's what we added for the cordwood. We left... Yeah, see, we didn't leave any of those back here. We just have the Heisler there. Okay. And then we have this. We don't have any cars over here, do we? We just have Betsy. Okay, so let's check down here at the oil refinery. That's got to be where they are. So we left them over here on this big siding. Yep. Okay, so ET needs to come one, two, three, four. We only have four of them here and we have two of them on the other thing. Okay, so we're going to need three more total. I'm just trying to decide how we're going to do this with ET. Should we bring ET over the mountain? And then grab these? And then go over to the other end? I mean, this is going to be a long... It's going to be a long trip, I can tell you that much. <laughs> Alright, yeah, we could bring ET e over the mountain and into this and then... Uh, or we could... Or we could go to the, um, we're going to have to go to the freight depot here in order to, because uh, we're going to have to buy some, so we might as well just buy five of them, I'm thinking. Maybe just buy five of them and then put these five on the track together and then pick these up and then pick the other ones up. I think that's what we're going to do. So let's get these purchased. Flat card. Do we have paint jobs on these yet? Yeah, we do. Okay. All right. So we're going to buy five of them. We're going to start with number three. Okay. And then we're going to buy... Whoops. Not that. We're going to buy five of these. There we go. And then we're going to do... Number five. And then number six. That's four of them, right? Yep. And then one more. There we go. All right. So we got all those. We can get these. Um, let's put the breaks off. And we're going to put the last one on the bottom of the hill with the brakes on. So we're going to go like this. We're going to re-rail this one. Has it got it? Does it have it? Okay. So we're going to put the flat car at the bottom of the hill here. And then we're going to put a in in it. Rerail. Alright. And we're gonna put a pin in the back. And we'll do that with the with these. We're gonna put our pin in the back. Alright. 
get this one down here. Pin in the back. Rerail. Now you know why they have a hump at the <laughs> at the rail yards, right? Come on, you can do it. You already knew that. Of course you already knew that. And there we go. Last one. Come on, you can do it. There we go. Okay. So we'll get all these hooked up and do this. Turn on our lantern. We have that one. This one's ready to go. And is that that one? Yeah. Okay. I was just getting disoriented as to which one I was on. There we go. All right. And then the last one here. So we're going to take these five and the other four, and I think we're going to need to bring ET across the map to get to pick everything up. So I think we will go over the hill and then come around this way. But then we're going to have basically have to make a big loop around the entire map. So yeah, we're going to come over the hill. We're going to come back around, grab those, come all the way around here, and put, add these onto here, and then go all the way the other side and everything. Cool. All right, let's do this. And let's find ET here. Did we disconnect this? We did disconnect it. Did we put the brakes on? Yeah, we put the brakes on. Okay, it's all good. All right, so we are good to uh, good to bring ET across. I think the biggest thing with ET was that it could go 29 instead of like 22, and it was like painfully slow going 22 on on the class 70. I think that's what it was. Don't quote me on that, but. <laughs> I think that's what we were not enjoying with the last one. Okay. Get this to pass the switch there. And then we can do this. And we're going to take our lantern back off. All right. Let's do this. We're going to go. This one should be able to push itself up the hill. Yeah, I can't see the speed because... Let's see. Yeah, it looks like about 90%. Yeah, I can't say the speed because I, I don't have the screen for this one popped up, but we're definitely going fast enough. I don't think we need to worry about making it up the hill. Turn off the generator. It is a little bit steeper at the top, isn't it? Alright, and I need to make sure that switch is the right way. Oh, we came up with the climax, so yeah, the switch is the right way. Alright, cool. And we'll just do this. We're going to see if our brakes do okay on this. I think our brakes are going to be plenty. We're going to leave the regulator at just a tiny bit so that we can hear if we're speeding up or slowing down. <laughs> The audio, audio speedometer, right? It seems like we're going about reasonable speed. Just a little bit of wobble, that's what you want. Then you know you're getting close to to crazy speeds, but you're not quite there yet. 
Okay. And I think we're going to need to um, flip some switches here before we get through. Are we even going to be able to get through? Yeah. Okay, so are we... Yeah, we're on the right. We're on the right one. Okay, our switches are already set for us. Awesome. And that is off the foul? Just barely, but yes. Okay, cool. There we go. Alright, we're just going to coast down this hill. Was it this one that when they first did it, the, this could go 30, but the, the tender couldn't? <laughs> I think it was this one that had the problems with the tender flying off the track. <laughs> as soon as it went past 22. Uh, that's awesome. Mal uh, malicious design, right? <laughs> Alright. I need to adjust my camera, I know. <laughs> Again. It's because the monitor moved or something. So, yeah, I'm going to have to adjust my monitor, too. I can't see the, like, the very upper left of my monitor. It's because the cats come up here and rub on them and move them around. All right, we're going to have to make sure that our switch is set. Oh, we did switch. We did set the switch for this. Okay. And I believe we are set on the... Let's see. No, we don't have a pin on there. It took it off. Okay. Make sure these are ready to go and have brakes. Okay, cool. Let's do it. Reverser. There we go. Perfect. Okay. We're going to stand here. And we'll get... Nope. There we go. All right, so let's take off the brakes on these. Zero. Zero. Okay, yeah, we're coasting. Okay. We're coasting. We don't have brakes on. All right, let's go like... Do, can we go... No, we can't go through there. Okay. We're going to have to go this way. And we need to get the back car past the switch here. And then we can flip it to go the other way. So we'll get that. Wish we could flip it on there. That would be awesome. Okay. We'll go like that, and that's going to push it this way. Yep. Okay. And then these are going to go. That's going to go the right way. Okay. And then I think the rest of them are probably okay. There's one way up by the... The one by the logging camp, or the sawmill, we're going to need to fix. in order to do this but we are facing the right direction too we want to be backwards so we can um, butt into the other tracks all right we're going through Tom we'll do this give it a little bit here in a second make sure it goes up the hill there we go There we go. All right. How many? We have tons of pipes there. Okay, good. See, we're going to end up going on that outside track. 
So it's going to send us through the sawmill when we get up there if we don't go switch, flip the switch. So we'll probably want to go flip the switch. How are we doing? We're good on fuel? Okay. Yeah, we'll see if we can get this... We'll see if we can get this uh, hooked up, our big train hooked up, before we finish up here. We can do our trip around the whole map. There comes the sawmill. So yeah, we're gonna have to flip the switch up here. Okay, let's go flip it. See if we can get that before the train gets there. Then we don't have to completely stop. All right, although it's gonna stop before we get back. Yep, okay, cool. Let's do it. Brakes. Shimmy on the track. <laughs> All right, the other one we need to worry about is when we go past the Betsy. But I think that one's okay. All right. What is that called? The the town thingy, the freight depot is where Betsy's parked. So we got to make sure we don't ram into Betsy when we, you know, get to the freight depot. That our switch is set to send us the other direction. Let's see if we can see it. I'm getting better at seeing those off at a distance, though. I will say that much. I can see them at a distance a lot better than I used to be able to. I can tell what they're going to be. I think part of that is just the trees not in the way. <laughs> but yeah, part of that is I don't... Uh, I, my brain is automatically decoding it now. I don't have to like calculate which way it's going to go. Except for the triple switches. Yeah, we're good. Okay. We're good on that one, and then we're going to need to make sure that we... I think we do need to flip the other switch past the depot. We'll see. Yeah, we're going to need to flip it. Okay. Go like this. It's this one. All right. No, nope. turn the brakes off. Thank you. I don't know what it's doing there. All right. Let's go. <laughs> and I didn't turn on the bell when we went through town. Totally forgot. All right. I was too worried about that switch. Okay, yeah, that should that should get us all nine cars lined up. Actually, we need more than nine, don't we? Well, we will grab those other two then when we go around because we're going to go around that way anyway, so we'll grab those two when we do that. And we'll bring 11 of them then because that'll be 99. So it'll basically empty out the pipes. That should be cool. That should give us enough for the... I think the oil field needed a lot of pipes. And that's where we needed them. It'd be kind of cool if you could turn on or off the thingies. Okay. Alright, let's do this. And this. And let's go put a pin on this one. And make sure that this one is good. Okay. Cool. Are we... Oh, yeah, we're doing fine. Okay. Let's go put that... Is it that one? Is it this one? Where was it? Is it the next one? There it is. That. And I think we're all good here, so let's turn off all the brakes and make sure... 
Turn off all the brakes. Zero. Zero. These ones are red, so I can't see them on the thing. Zero. <laughs> I can't see them on the corner of my screen. Uh, that's awesome. All right. You know, 1800s problem, 19th century problems, right? Can't see the corner of your monitor. All right, and then all the brakes are off. Okay, so I think we're good on that. So let's head this way. Whoops, wrong way. Yep, we're gonna head up this way and then we're gonna go um, hook up the other two cars maybe. This is where they're all gonna fly up the track, right? I think we're gonna wanna stop up before we get to this merge anyway so that we'll have room to uh, to put everything back on. Because we're gonna need to pull the other train up past the switch and then leave the two cars on the track. Yeah. So yeah, we'll do that next time because we're, we're running out of time here. So that's going to be it for episode 56. Join me in episode 57. And uh, what we're going to do is we're going to take this around, fill it all up with pipes, probably pull the boxcars too for the fun of it. See if we can maybe do that. We'll just pull the boxcars and the pipes. And that's when the boxcars are going to fall off. <laughs> you know, right? Okay, so, but anyway, yeah, that's going to be it for 56. Join me in episode 57, we'll figure it all out, and we'll see you then. Later.